the ensemble will miss you in Mary Celeste. <coughs> You may or may not have read all about it. And if you have, it may or may not have been the truth. Welcome to another edition of 10 Minute Unsolvable Sea Mysteries. Today, we will be looking at the mysterious tale of the Mary Celeste. The Mary Celeste, a ship found off the coast of Portugal in 1872 with no sign of its 10 passengers and crew, baffled media and led people including well-known newspapers, to question logic by composing strange and outrageous theories that stick with us throughout time. This demonstrates the power of a mystery, power of mysteries, and the media's determination to solve them. In the case of the Mary Celeste, there was just simply not enough information given to us. All we know is that there were 10 people that set up and none returned. When the captain of the DeGracia discovered the ship sailing in a strange course and sent men on board, they noticed that all the materials were untouched. Yet, the Boston Post still claims that it was pirates. But what pirate would leave a ship full of alcohol untouched? <laughs> <laughs> they also noted that there was no sign of the crew. And there was Oliver DeVoe, the first man to search the boat, noted that there was an eerie indent in the young Sophia's bed along with the rest of the unmade beds. The family and the crew had obviously left in a hurry, but why? The lifeboat was also noted missing, but where had it gone? Why has nobody solved this mystery? And why are there so many stories? on the Mary Celeste. Strange theories, outrageous theories. <laughs> I tell you, America just can't handle the truth. <sighs> Let's see. Well, the mystery is much easier to solve once I've moved it off the coast of Portugal into, let's see, the Bermuda Triangle. You see, mysterious things happen in the Bermuda Triangle all the time, and the Mary Celeste was definitely mysterious. I may also leave out one tiny bit of information. The lifeboat was gone. It's only a way out. Who needs that? All right, perfect. Now we have 10 people, poof, gone, vanished in the middle of the Bermuda Triangle. <sighs> and I, after years and years of intense research, which may or may not have happened, I know what happened. It was aliens. <laughs> and who was there to prove me wrong? There's no information out there for anyone. And besides, if the newspaper can say it was pirates, I can say it was aliens. Sarah Briggs, and I'm here to tell you my tale. Well, if it's not I, then whom? 38, 23 north is where they found the Mary Celeste. 1715 degrees west is where they never found me. 12 4, 1872. The dreaded date my daughter Sophia never saw her second birthday. <sighs> The date my son Arthur lost his parents, and the day I, Sarah Briggs, vanished, along with my husband and seven other crew members, all with families of their own, all who will never have closure, never know what happened. I was on the Mary Celeste, and in many ways, I forever will be. 
Due to a lack of information, the truth of my fate will never be spoken. All we have is a brief captain's log and very few letters that were written in port. I myself spoke of storms in one of these letters. But if that's the truth of what happened, will never be known. The simplest things could have changed my legacy. If only we had written in that log what had happened. If only we had time, then maybe I wouldn't be remembered. By being a part of one of the most unexplainable events, maybe I would be remembered by being brave in a time of struggle, or being quick-witted enough to save the day. Maybe my son could mourn in peace, knowing what happened to his family after all of these years. If only. Welcome back to Unsolvable Mysteries of the Sea. Now that you know, do you have your own theories? Many have tried. In fact, the Mary Celeste was a court case. The Mary Celeste was even created into a book and a movie. Many news articles were written, both trying to pass off the event and composing their own strange and outrageous theories. To this day, people are still producing new theories, each more outrageous than the first. It seems as everyone wants this mystery solved. It's almost as if they can't have a mystery that they don't know happened. And with so many outrageous theories out there, no wonder we trust the media. It seems like the most legitimate source. The Mary Celeste also demonstrates the power of a mystery and how it sticks with us throughout time. Big time news corporations still describe things, mysterious things, using this incident. Even something as ridiculous as bees disappearing. So what really happened on the Mary Celeste? Where are those 10 people? Well, the world may never know the truth. For now, all we can do is take what we're given and continue producing theories. Thank you for watching. Have a mysterious night. That's it.